This is something you know, being stark with those Nigeria, Niger, started the corruption, pillage, and the business of the of the months. Found their own more. They're going to go after Boko Haram. They're tired of the corruption. They're tired of the corruption in government. Tired of being treated like second class citizens. And you can't blame people for that. You can't blame people for that. People get tired of being second class citizens. <coughs> Excuse me. But it's got to be taken care of. They got to do something. Because too many people are dying in their country. They're doing nothing, so I stop them. It's going to do the president. It's going to, it's going to, they're just going to go after Boko Haram. They're two troops. Two, two people are being massacred. People are being massacred. It's a sadness to human life. But people are tired of the corruption. People are tired of the corruption in government. As we should be with our government. We should be able to argue the corruption. The corruption in our government is something unbelievable. Sadness to human life. The corruption in Nigeria is even worse because it costs lives. It costs lives. And that's a sadness to human life. That should be stopped. And hopefully they'll get it stopped. Hopefully they'll get a hold of it. Hopefully they'll get poke around. Between Chad and Canada alone. Can. In Nigeria, they should be able to stop it. Gotta stop. Gotta stop. It's a Sunday noon being a star news. Thank you for watching.